Hey guys, um, admittedly I didn't really have much planned, uh, admittedly um, I never planned to do this video, I've just sort of come in to the loft and just started like, I don't know, um, sort of like thinking over the last sort of day or so, um, about what's gone on yesterday. Sunday afternoon now. Um, it's safe to say yesterday's racing was a disaster. Now, I've been reading the comments and posts all over Facebook across the forums, um, and it seems all across the country, um, even some parts of Europe. Uh, yeah, even some parts of Europe. Um, had an absolute disaster. There's appears there's like hundreds, if not thousands, upon thousands of birds um, that have gone missing. Um, you know, some people will be coming out on, you know, would have come out to their loss this morning. Um, you know, and just found empty perches. Um, and just the thought of that. Um, it's scary. To say the least, it's scary. Um, I'm fortunate enough, if you can say that, um, that I wasn't racing. Now, it wasn't due to any kind of, you know, uh, foresight or higher education or any of that. Um, it was quite simply that my birds over the last year have not been ready to race. Um, I'm sure if they were ready then I'd be sat, you know, in the same position as many of you. Um, it must be absolutely devastating. Um, you know, I'm, you know, this wasn't a case of sending birds that weren't fit. Um, you know, something has clearly gone on. Uh, that's knocked with their navigation or, or you know, something. Um, I can't explain it. And so far, from what I've seen, there's like not many people who really have much of an idea of what's happened. Um, the best theory that seems to be close to what's gone on, I think, is a combination of stuff with. Um, the east east winds, um, low lying clouds. Uh, combine that with um, the thunderstorms in the upper atmosphere. Um, you know, it seems a whole mixing part of um, bad race situations all mixed into one, and it's come up with an absolute disaster. Um, <coughs> I saw that there's, there's a one-off race, I believe it's a one-off race, um, in Romania, uh, in the northern part of Romania. Um, it sent, from what I can tell, it's a translated message, but from what I can tell, it sent 8,800 birds, um, and they had just 600 return home on the day. Um, yeah, that alone is a loss of over 8,000 birds. Um, you know, and I mean, well done to everyone who um, got birds home yesterday and, you know, they placed, um, you know, they've taken prize positions. Um, you know, I'm not taking anything away from you. You deserve it. Um, you know, those birds have obviously... Um, fought, fought to get home, um, you know, and they are a credit to you. Um, you know, but unfortunately, um, you know, there's far many more that um, haven't made it home as yet. Hopefully, in the next uh, few days or so, um, they'll be able to work their way home. Um, my fingers are crossed for you, are crossed for the birds, um, you know, 
Um, ho hopefully they do make it home because the idea of walking into a loft, um, you know, not having any birds there waiting for you when you come in, um, it's devastating. It's depressing. Uh, to quote, quite sure, it's depressing, and I wouldn't wish that on anybody. Um, you know, and um, you know, if if I get any birds in um, that obviously aren't mine, um, you know, if they come down or if I see anything on the local groups, um, you know, the local Facebook pages and stuff saying about lost birds. Um, you know, I will, I will do my part, I will take them in, um, and then I will contact you to say that I've got them, um, and then if I get them as close to home as I can, um, you know, or build them back up so that they're fit, ready to go, and release back to you when the conditions are better. Um, you know, that's something that um, I hope that people would do for me. Um, I've seen a lot of people on Facebook are saying um, that that's what they will be doing, and I think it's only fair. You know, this isn't the fault of um, us as flyers or fancies, it isn't the fault of the birds. There's something that's clearly gone on and knocked them way out, and I don't think any of us could have predicted it. Um, you know, it's just. It's, I hate to say it, but it's, it's one of those things, it's part of the sport, I suppose, and it, it's not something um, that, you know, we can predict. Um, I just hope, and I know I've said it already, but I really hope these birds do return home and do work their way back. I'm, I'm sure the majority of them will in the next few days. Um, you know, I really hope so. Um, you know, and not just for me, because obviously, like I say, I wasn't racing. Um, I have friends that have are missing birds. I've um, acquaintances on like Facebook and stuff that um, are also missing birds. Um, so for their sake and for the birds' sake, I really hope. I really hope um, they do work back and I, I know I'm rambling at this point um, so I am going to wrap it up I think um, I was, was going to say something else um, there's a couple, couple of groups or posts on Facebook um, that I'm sure most of you would have seen um, it's basically trying to get an idea for what's gone on. Um, I think it's a really good idea. Um, we should be trying to figure out um, what has gone on, whether it's weather conditions or you know space flares or um, you know anything, whatever it is. Um, if we can better understand it, it's going to help us to understand the birds' navigation um, abilities a bit better. Uh, it's going to help us to understand the birds a bit better and by doing so it will help us um, to prevent it happening in the future so if if any of us can help out with that um, I think we should um, so definitely that's something to keep an eye out on and um, if you haven't subscribed already uh, to my channel then you know hit the button down below um, you know, I'm trying to put these out uh, with some sort of regularity. Um, I'll be looking to start some more videos focusing on my young birds because that's where I'm planning to be racing. Um, you know, and then in the next few weeks, um, I'll be starting to take them on the road. Um, they have currently been going around the loft, and they're going quite well. Um, you know, quite well around the home. They're kind of in that um, uncoordinated stage at the minute, but hopefully in the next few days they'll start kitting up properly. Um, and then after that, when they start disappearing for a bit or a while, I'll be starting to take them down the road. Um, 
so you know hit subscribe um, like the videos um, you know um, you know I look forward to seeing you and if you want to leave any comments down below uh, I look forward to reading them I'll respond to everyone that I get um, yeah so keep an eye out and I'll uh, I'll see you in the next video thank you very much